Hey everybody, welcome back to Hypermind Vanilla. This is Lapis Lori, and guess what? I have new internet. I have new internet. I have new internet, and it's wonderful. Yes, it is. Hey, I just want you guys to know it's been a little while since I've had a regular LP episode, and that's because I'm moved, and everything is ready now. All the things are working. The internet's great. I've been streaming, and I love it. It is amazing. But you guys need an LP episode here on the Hypermind server, so that's what we're going to do. And I've been working steadily, slowly but surely, on this lovely apartment complex. Let's get back into normal view one more time, and I'll show you kind of an overview of what I've gotten done. Uh, let me check my sounds as well because I was streaming, not the resource pack, uh, and I had to adjust a few things to make sure it sounded right when I was streaming. Okay, here we are. Now you can hear me doing things, hopefully. You can hear the water. You can hear me walking on things. All right, so we have basically four buildings. Let's climb up top here, and I'll show you what we've got, okay? got a little bit of a basic minecart elevator. I'm walking over the top of the skeleton spawner, which you guys probably knew about. Um, I don't know if I like the fence post there when you're walking. It makes it look a little weird. We'll hop up here. We'll put a torch up there apparently as well. And what I got done on stream was basically kind of working on this overpass and the steps that go down into these buildings. But there's going to be four buildings. One, two, three, four. And at the bottom level there's going to be a commercial layer of things like a coffee shop, a milk house, um, make, what was it, maybe an antique store. And then I've got some signs down here for some some suggestions, but I think I'm going to save a lot of the building and for streaming just because it's a fun activity to do and you get a lot of input from people. So definitely catch me on Twitch. It's Twitch TV. Uh, slash lapis underscore Lori, the same as my game name, uh, the same as my Twitter name, so you guys can definitely find me there. It's a lot of activity that goes on. I try to stream several times a week, um, and still some weekend mornings, so that all my regular viewers on that time slot don't get neglected. Um, but today, I had a great idea. Somebody gave me, an, I wanted to do a mural on the wall that's over here by this, and I'll show you what I want to do. Um, somebody had suggested Morse code, write something in Morse code. And I thought, well, that's a pretty good idea. But see, we have this huge palette right here. And what I could do also is, or the enchanting runes. And I did a little research on the enchanting runes that come up when you're in here enchanting something. Let's just go have a look at something really quick. Um, let's say you're over here and you're going to enchant something. Let's just grab a little bit of lapis. And we'll grab... Uh, let's make something cool. What are we going to make? Everybody needs a new pair of boots. Okay, so we're going to craft a pair of boots. We're going to make them. Now when you put it in here, you see those little runes that come circling down here? You see those little letters? Well, that's what I'm going to put on the wall. And I got to researching those runes. And what happens is that Minecraft also has this alphabet. But if you look at something called the Standard Galactic Alphabet, that's what they're using. I was unaware of that. Now, I'm not sure exactly where the standard galactic alphabet might be used, but it's still kind of cool. So we're going to write out a secret message in uh, Rune, R-U-N-E, Rune, I guess is the more proper pronunciation, and in the standard galactic alphabet. And I'll let you guys decipher it and let me know what you think about what it says. Um, <clears throat> I may give it away during the build because I'm, I'm not that swift at it. But here we go. Oh, I only have one lapis. We need three to do a good enchant on some boots. So let's do that. We'll make something awesome. What do we got here? Oh, I don't have enough levels. I only have 14 levels. Silly me. Well, okay, next time, that's what we'll do. We'll have a spare pair of, pair of boots, but I wanted to give the demonstration on this, these things floating down from the bookcases. So that's the exciting part. And so that's what I want to do today. And we're going to make it in prismarine on the walls. Hopefully we have enough of that. I think we do. Um, let's have a bit of a snack here while it rains. And the way I have kind of deciphered this is that the letters need to be six blocks high, and I'm going to start them two blocks up. So that means up to eight to the top. So that should work out pretty well. Let's have a sleep, and I'll be right back, and we'll start on our project. 
Okay, welcome back. We have quite a few supplies in our inventory and what we're going to end up doing with this is I'm going to build a basic framework. I said I wanted to start them two up and that's what we're going to do. But I got to looking and I was like, okay, what if we had a framework for this so that they looked really nice as they uh, were here. So we're going to build it out from this wall because if you remember on the other side of this is this giant thing. Yikes! So scary. So we're just going to leave that there and I'm going to build out over the top of it. And I'm going to do it six high. One, let's just do this. One, two, three, four, five, six. And that's that. And then we're going to do another solid area here. So this is going to be the framework for our kind of like mural up to this level. And that works out really well because that means there's like one above here and one below. I think, I think that's how that works. And then we could do some decorative trim, which I thought would be kind of cool. Now, I don't know if it'll stretch all the way around or not but we'll see. But I just thought it was an interesting concept and this could be like a nice um, finished area here. It could be a nice border. We'll clean it up really nice so it looks good. Get rid of these overhangs. Just kind of fill it all in where it needs to go. Clean it all up. Zoom. So let's get back to our task. Over here we're going to make some letters and what I want to do is make it a word and I have to make sure there's enough room, but I think there is in looking at it, and maybe you guys can guess it once it's built. Uh, you'll have to do your research, and if you really can't figure it out, you can ask, but I'd like you guys to really, really try to get it on your own, okay? I want you to really, 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 really try. Can I get that way up there? I can. So what we're gonna end up doing is we're gonna make the first letter, and it's gonna be this letter, and we're gonna use green for the letters. Eh. I think that's right. Let's count them to be sure. I think that's the correct thing. What can I get rid of? I have one too many items in my inventory. Sadly, probably the brick. We'll come back for it in a minute. I just can't do the transitions on it. It won't let me. One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. Okay. So, and then the next part of this letter will have uh, two little thingies, and they're going to be right here, here, and here. That looks right. And then there's going to be a division. So we're going to make all this gray in between the letters. And if I get creative, then I'll work on a little bit of something else. But I'm already kind of liking the plan. I think it's kind of charming. Um, so the next letter will be a little more complex. Some of these can be up to six blocks wide. Um, But I don't think we need to be that wide, but I think that gives us the idea of what we want. And then we're going to have a divider of this stone right here. And Zlow had in Morse code, so I'm going to attribute this to Zlow because it was his idea to write something on the wall in text. So it'll be like a billboard sort of. Uh, and the next letter, ooh, it's a little more fun. Oh, not that way. Boom. We're going through the green faster than I thought. And then we're going to have one gap like this. Fill it all in with gray. So if you guys figure this out before I'm done, write it in the, write it in the uh, comments down below and let me know when you figured it out. What, what word do you think I'm writing? Okay, you let me know. Could be that you know right now, could be that you're still figuring it out. Hopefully someone gets it. I think it's kind of a cool idea. Um, yeah, so there we go. All right, there is three letters and we need uh, another one. Let's figure out what that one's gonna be. It is pretty easy to do as well. So we're gonna have our divider. This is between every letter and then it goes, let's just say like that. Let's leave it like that, like this one. That makes sense. I think that's right. Yep, looks cool to me. And then our letter here is also a two stacker. And it's gonna be like this. Perfect, just like that. So if you're up on your <laughs> galactic alphabet, that makes a word. 
you'll have to figure out what word that is. All right? You let me know if you figure it out before I'm I'm done building it. Write it in the comments, and we'll just see how it goes. So, uh, interesting thing is that we did a little ABBA caving with the group, and if you hadn't noticed on my channel, there is a lovely little video called Hypermine is Accepting Applications. So, if you are interested in playing on Hypermine, you're over the age of 16, and you are a regular content producer and think you can produce regular vanilla content for us, please look at the link down below. I'll provide a link to the application video. Watch it and use the Google form that's uh, enclosed in the description for it. And that's all I'm going to say about that today. But if you're interested in playing, we are interested in seeing your marvelous content. Okay? Uh, let's put this one here and here. I think that'll work. And I don't know if we'll have room for all these, but that's all right. We can go around the corner. So that is the start of our second word. I don't know if I can get that in there or not. Being a little sloppy with it. All right, and we're gonna go back to this one because I've got to repeat this one. All right, that seems legit. We'll work on that. Nope, this way. Yep, that looks good. I'm going to pop this one in right here. Mm, nope, let's go up one and then down. Okay. I want them to be the same, and I can't seem to get my double stack figured out. But it's just a fun little thing I'm doing. It's not nothing terrible, no secret message, other than it's just a fun thing, fun thing to say. Like I said, I hope you guys are going to get it pretty soon. It won't, won't take too long to figure out. Once you research what intergalactic and Minecraft ruins might be here on the the great Googles. I'm sure you'll figure it out. And then we need this letter again. This is also a familiar letter. Let's look. Oh, I gotta have a gray right there. That's not gonna work. Um, I think I think I can mm, tell you what. Oh, how am I gonna work it? I didn't actually count it because I thought it would fit, but I was wrong. So let's. Let's go this route. We're going to go here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we're going to have this all in here in just a minute. Okay, everybody, we're back. And I only had to move this back three blocks. So we just erased part of the mountain again. All for this one space so that we could have the edge, the space, and then the start of a new wall right here. So we have made two words. Uh, hopefully everybody can read that. Yeah, sure, it's all right on it. And then what we're going to end up doing is putting another word here and then maybe just some little decoration back on this side because we're not going to have to put any other words other than the one I'm going to write right now. And that one word starts right here. So we're going to get, uh, first we're going to go back and get our green back from where we stashed it. Now where was that? I think it was down here because it was quick and handy. Quick and handy, we'll go down to the basement and we'll pick it right up. There it is, all the green. So we can leave some of this here, pick up this, and our blo blog, blah, 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 bricks. Our brick, bl our stone, bl let's just say brick. Yeah, stone brick. That's right. That's the word I'm looking for. That is the word. It is a word. It is wonderful. And so what we need to do here is there's going to be a top portion of this that is a little centered like this. One, two, three. I think we can do it this way. Um, I think we can. No, let's do this. We gotta do it in two portions, so we're gonna have it like this. Like that. So there's one. Looks good. Right? Okay, and let's go next door and do the next letter. Maybe we can get this filled in in the meantime. We'll come in like this. Okay, it makes sense to me. And then there, our next letter starts here, and it will be uh, just like this. It will be. Do, 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 do. I think we gotta go that wide for this one. It's pretty good sized. Uh, we could probably take one off. It'll still represent. Can we reach over here with this one? Hey, yes, just barely. Put that there, and then this will go like this, and there. So that is our next letter. 
the next letter. I feel like Vanna White. And our next letter is this one. I should... If we could just get our Minecraft hands up in the air, like Vanna White, we could display that really nicely. Uh, and the next letter is kind of unique as well. I don't think I've used it yet. Nope, have not. So this is a new one. We're going to end up with this, 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 and this. Just like that. Make sure that's correct. Yep. And then we're going to repeat this letter right here. So let's do that. We're going to put our divider in right here. And then we're going to bring the green down in a solid line and make like a little L shape here. And then one up in that corner. And that completes our saying. And I hope everyone has fun trying to figure it out. It's supposed to be an entertaining game. Nothing struggling. It's nothing terribly hard. So let's take a look at that like this. It just looks like random letters, but it is indeed a word. And we're going to end up filling this in here, maybe doing just some sort of overall pattern. Let's see what we can do. Um, let's go ahead and fill it in with this stone, and I'll be right back. That way we've got a clean base to work from. Okay, we're back, and I think I'm going to make one big word. I think it'll fit. We're going to find out for sure. We're going to make make double sure. And the first letter starts like this. We're just going to go ahead and put these in, and then um, I'll try to do a little speedy up bit here, and then you guys can cipher it out when we're all done. All right, so that's what I'll do. I just want to let you know that I am going to finish a word instead of doing, oh, Instead of doing a uh, any kind of design on the wall, I thought it would be more interesting to write this word. So I'm going to do that, and we'll do a little speedy up bit, and I hope you enjoy it. Oh, nailed it. Nailed it. Turned out perfect spacing for this side. Love it. It's going to look really nice. And I hope everyone enjoys deciphering it. Put this one right here. Perfect. There you go. A little bit of a cheerleader support. Let's put a little light under here so we can see it all right. A little bit of lighting underneath makes it look very nice. Makes it look like daylight because it is. It is daylight. Okay, so we're going to give you the broad angle of this and you guys can decide what it says. There you go. There's two words. And there's a word. And then we start another word here and it'll be harder to get a broad spectrum look at it. I'll just have to go like this. There you go. That's the word. I hope everyone has fun trying to decipher it. And that's my episode today on the Hypermind server. And we're going to head out here. We're just going to keep running, 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 running. Thanks for joining me again. Thanks for your patience during my move and the transition to the new internet. Definitely check me out on Twitch TV. And, you know, if you like the show, enjoy the puzzle. And uh, feel like you want to come back and visit again, hit that follow button for sure. Okay? And we'll see you next time. Bye.